What is road lighting design? Road lighting design and engineering comprises the lighting design, lighting installation, construction, operation, and maintenance to safeguard acceptable and unvarying lighting levels are provided for all road users like drivers and pedestrian safety. Road lighting proposal assists lighting designers to develop a lighting 3D model to eliminate dark spots, offer a clear view of the street and allied infrastructure to deliver adequate lighting for all road users. Module 1, Road Lighting Engineering. In the first module, we have covered important industries of road lighting engineering, fundamentals of road lighting engineering slash design, site review criteria, before starting road lighting design and road lighting jargons. Within the lighting jargons, we have explained arm length, setback distance, straight vertical distance, mounting height, candela, CD, illuminance, E, foot candle, FC, luminance, L, the lumen, LM, lux, LX, etc. Module 2, Road Lighting Design Process. In the second module, we have covered the fundamentals of road lighting design, luminaire choices, street lighting mounting choices. The principal procedures of road lighting design are the luminance technique and the illuminance technique. Similarly, the module commends the illuminance level of numerous types of road, mid-block crossings, junction forms, etc. Finally, the module explains the notion of BUG rating arrangement that delivers a mathematical rating of the luminaire light supply as it applies to the road lighting trespass and glare. The module explains the thumb rule to determine the mounting height of the lighting column. Module 3, Lighting Network Communication and Maintenance. In the third module, we have covered the road lighting pillar protection procedures, road lighting cable network, passively safe lighting columns, road lighting maintenance regime, and smart lighting systems. When road lighting columns are located adjacent to the road curb line or road edge, or at any exposed location, it is highly likely to be hit by a delinquent vehicle. There are two probable ways to guard it, either by introducing a vehicle restraint system or by providing passively safe road lighting poles. The module has explained both measures in a detailed manner. The module also described innovative street lighting systems like low RAWAN. The full form of low RAWAN is long range wide area network. Low RAWAN works in the principles of Internet of Things, IoT, requirements such as bi directional communication, end to end security, mobility, and localization services without the issues of bandwidth and needing huge servers. Module 4 LED Road Lighting. In the fourth module, we have covered the various aspects of road LED lighting, benefits of LED road lighting, application of LED road lighting and LED implementation challenges. The full form LED is light emitting diode, and as the name suggests LED lights are diodes that produce superior quality light with superior lumen efficiency and superior lumen produce. The module also explained motion sensor street lighting technologies. Motion sensor street lightings are activated when the sensor detects a moving vehicle or pedestrian, and if there is no traffic movement, it reduces the illumination to 20% efficacy levels to save energy. Module 5, Road Lighting Standard Details. In the fifth module, we have covered standard details of various components of road lighting poles, feeder pillars, LED lanterns, and lighting chambers. Feeder pillar is placed to accommodate street lighting cutout and isolator. It is supplied with hot-dipped galvanized corrosion protection. In addition, we have also included a bonus deal and provided very useful 20 interview questions and guidelines for a civil engineer job opportunity. It will significantly benefit fresh civil engineers to adequately prepare for the job interviews. Please sign up with GCELab.com, attend our lighting engineering course, and make a promising career as a lighting engineer.